The Washington Nationals started their first season in Major League Baseball in 2005 after the Montreal Expos were no longer able to carry a franchise and were located to Washington, D.C. The Expos came into baseball as an expansion franchise in 1969 and were the first Canadian team to compete in the league. The 1994 baseball strike can take the blame for canceling the remainder of the 94 season in August and being responsible for the beginning of the end for Montreal. When the strike was over, the team sold or traded all of their high-profile players, which led to a fan's lack of interest, and as a result, Montreal was no longer able to support a team. 2014 marked the 10th season that the Nationals played in Washington, and they easily took first place in the National League East Division. They finished the year 96-66 and and were 17 games clear of the Mets and Braves that were tied in the standings behind them. It was the first year that former player Matt Williams took the managerial job after Davey Johnson retired from coaching. The team earned home field advantage in the National League, but were unable to get out of the first round of the playoffs, losing in four games to the eventual champion San Francisco, three games to one. Some players to watch for 2015 are Steven Strasburg. He has been the opening day starting pitcher for the last three seasons and will once again be looked upon as the ace of the staff. He went 14-11 in 2014 with an ERA of 3.14 in 34 starts. Denard Spann set the team's single season record last year with 184 hits, but due to recent injuries and off-season surgery, he may be off the field until mid-May. Ryan Zimmerman and Jason Wirth will, of course, be relied upon to put up consistent numbers throughout the 2015 season. Zimmerman makes the move to first base this year after the release of Adam LaRoche, hoping to give his often injured throwing shoulder less stress. With the National League East being a weak division, the Nationals are favored to win again. The line setters are revealing that they expect them to go even further with reasonable odds to win the World Series. Their starting pitching is among the best in baseball, with Strasburg, Zimmerman, and Gio Gonzalez leading the way. Doug Fister and Max Scherzer are also in the rotation this year, and both former Detroit Tigers standouts are also expected to put up decent numbers in the National League. We see a 93.5 team wins total being offered this year, and we do not see this as a hard number to reach. As long as the team stays healthy and their pitching staff can stay on the field, we will surely expect them to reach the 96 win plateau once again, so this team total going over is the play.